area that was searched for the girls, what are some of the challenges that the searchers might have encountered? And what kinds of things were they be looking for? Well, certainly access was tough because it's very rural. And um, there's a lot of rolling hills out there and there's a, there's, there's a lot of woods. Um, so that's always a challenge. The, the one thing that was not an issue at the time was foliage on the trees. Um, so visually there was more available than there, there would have been in the summertime before the leaves fell off. But that was a very challenging area, no doubt about that. From the wall closer perspective, we try and look at these as a very methodical grid search. But you have to consider the worst case scenario too, so that you don't do what you just said. And that's, you might trample on evidence, you might miss something, you might think something's not important that it is. We don't know who's out there, who's where, who's done what, who saw, who picked up, all those things. So that's that's a challenge. Oh, and that not just was not a, just a challenge here, but it was a challenge everywhere. Mm -hmm. yeah, anywhere that these kinds of things happen. Um, especially in a rural area like that. So that, it did create many challenges for us. Somebody searching the house, the garage, the outbuildings, the field behind the outbuildings, even into the woods. This is just a few hundred yards away from the girls where from where the girls' bodies were found. Who'd ever think someone would be murdered in your backyard? The crime scene, the area where their, their bodies were found, from what I've been told and from, from being there, is very hard to reach. And some have speculated that it's only reachable if you cross this creek or if you... And the speculation is that this is a person that was very familiar with the terrain. Can you speak to that at all? One thing I'd say is any place in, in the country that's rural, there's multiple points of access, generally speaking especially in, in Indiana, that's hilly, but uh, mostly flat. So again, that's, there's a lot of speculation as to why they might have been there, um, but I'm not gonna talk about it right now.